I'd like to share with you on the topic that I have titled Networking the Right Way. Networking the Right Way. It's hard work to network, but it is an investment that has great rewards. I get it. Networking can be consuming and even awkward sometimes, depending on your personality. But networking, when done right, can be the solution to some of the central struggles some of us may be dealing with. And that's the truth. In addition, a strong network can impact your career greatly and also give you a competitive edge throughout every stage of your career. Now, many of us are eagerly seeking to grow our network, and that's fine. But we go about it the wrong way. Typically, we go to events, conferences, and even professional or social hangouts in a bid to network. At those events, we hand out our business card and follow up with emails or calls with those we met. But nothing comes out of it. Nothing usually does. Listen to this. Listen to this. If you go to an event where networking is part of the title, everyone else going there does so also for the same purpose, to network. And each person consistently seeks to exchange cut after cut after a few conversations. <laughs> no. That is not how to network and get results. Not at all. You have to redefine what networking means to you for you to get the results you desire out of networking. Your key objective at places you go to, and I'm talking of everyday places like the gym, the shopping mall, grocery store, religious places, your old students association, wedding parties and related social events, professional events, etc. Your key objective in all of these places has to be how to relate with people you meet as human beings. It's about trying to build relationships with people and not about selling yourself or anything for that, ma that matter to the people you meet. It's about initiating a mutually beneficial relationship. You see, people will forget what you said and what you did, but they will never forget how you made them feel. That's an awesomely true quote by late Mayor Angelo, by the way. People will forget what you said and what you did, but they will never forget how you made them feel. Relating with people and consciously trying to build genuine relationships is where networking really happens. You achieve this by finding what you have in common or something you can do or give in making people feel special and genuinely appreciated. At such events, make it easy for people to want to talk with you. That's a starting point. I do this by drawing attention to myself, usually by something I, I am wearing. It could be a hat, a brooch, the shirt I'm wearing, or my shoes. Wear something that makes you stand out at such events. After being drawn to you, or perhaps you taking the initiative to walk up to people, you begin to move to retain their attention. You achieve this by moving the focus away from you to them. You may compliment them for something they are wearing or ask questions like, are you a guest of the bride or the groom if it's a wedding? Or is this the first time you are at a conference like this if it's a conference? Or when did you join this association or this community? Or are you resident in this town for events that people may have traveled in for? Or what brings you here today? Or what major thing are you working on at the moment? These are conversation starters that will usually break the ice and lead to other conversations as you get freer with each other. Your focus must be to try to get them to talk about themselves. It's not about you. And as they talk about themselves, you'll find things you have in common or things you can help them with, including who you may be able to connect them with in resolution of what they may be struggling with. Many people go to events just looking for what they can get from other people. No, that is not networking. It does not work that way. It is about what you can give to other people. It's about who or what you can connect them with. The more people you help, the more your network grows. Networking is about establishing 
building and nurturing long-term beneficial relationships with the people you meet. It is proven that the most connected people are often the most successful people. When you invest in your relationships, you receive multiple dividends down the line. Yes, it takes time. As I begin to wrap up, let me talk about networking at the workplace. This is very important. As many assume that networking is an activity reserved for after work hours outside the office, but nothing could be further from the truth. Nothing could be further from the truth. While there's much value in connecting with people who work in other organizations or industries, please don't discount the importance of networking in your place of work. Yes, networking with your colleagues can be incredibly beneficial to your career progression. Be intentional in developing professional relationships with colleagues in your department and in other groups' departments within your organization. Networking internally gives you leverage and access to opportunities within and outside your company through your network, through your colleagues. Again, networking is about what you can give to other people. It's about who or what you can connect other people with or to. The more people you help, the more your network grows. That is networking the right way. My name is Olu Soji Oyaoye, and I seek to enhance the capacity of anyone that I come across. Please let me know in the comment section which part of this clip resonates with you. Or simply share your perspective to enrich the discussion. I'd love to hear from you. And if you require my services as a life or business coach, you can reach me through my email info at sojioyawaye.com info at sojioyawaye.com info at sojioyawaye.com or by whatsapp chat only to plus two three four seven zero four three six six seven six zero seven plus two three four seven zero four three six six seven six zero seven plus two three four seven zero four three six six seven six zero seven Let's get out there and network, build relationships. See you at the top.